Everyone, my name is Nicole and I'm one of the assistant horsemen and riding instructors at Wendy Farm. This video is going to be about how I tie my rope directly to my halter. Okay, so we like to take a rope and tie it directly to our halter. And the reason for that is because it allows the feel of the rope to travel into the halter without any breaks in between. So when you add a snap, there's a lot of weight to that snap. It can hit them in the face. Um, it can break. There's a lot of reasons why I do not like to use a snap on my halter when I'm specifically doing horsemanship and tying my horses. But the important thing is that you tie this knot correctly because like the previous video on tying the halter up here, it will come undone if you do not do it right. So this is one way to tie this halter. I've seen some additional ways, but again, this is one way we like to do it. So first thing I want to point out actually is see how it wraps around this entire purple loop and because of that, when there's pressure from the halter or on the rope, it will act upon itself and stay tight and secure. Okay? It's also important that when you're tying a knot like this on a halter that your rope quality has a very thick um, core. Otherwise, it will collapse if a horse were to set back into it. This rope will collapse and this is very, very difficult to get undone. So, anyways, let's undo it here. So if I were to start from the beginning, halters with no rope and rope with no halter, I'm going to take my tail, come through bottom of the halter. Now the rope halter we went down and around like this. This is important that we go up. So your tail comes out to the right, up, and then around the back. After it comes around the back you have a D shape. And once it comes through there then you take the tail back across the loop and back through the D shape. Then you can pull tight. Now you can see that my knot is tied on this loop. Also something important to note is that you notice this tail, if this is the nose band, this tail is pointing away from the horse's cheek. If you tie this loop to where it would be pointing up into the jaw, you can have some irritation from the horse. He might be a little bothered by it. So one more time, when I'm undoing that, push the tail out, come all the way out. Here's the loop on the halter. Come through with your tail out to the right, up, and around the back. There's the D shape. Make sure you don't have any crisscross in it. If you have a crisscross, it won't tie right. There's the D shape. Come back across the purple loop and through the knot, and through the loop you created. Pull tight on the longer piece. And that's how you tie your rope to your halter. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. And please be sure to subscribe to our channel for more informational videos. Thanks for watching.